Diane Bolha murdered Rocky by an order given in Havana by Raul Castro, delivered by the Cuban intelligence to FBI and CIA officers who are conspiring, and backing Castro in the shadow for more than half a century. Rocky was a wonderful and loyal friend. I love Rocky so much. Rocky was a true friend, always by my side, always close to me, at all time, during the day and night, sleeping by the side of my bed. Rocky was a heavy and very strong boy, powerful, energetic, but at the same time, he was very nice, like a gentleman with his sister's princess, and Roxy, with his brother Tiger, with his mom Sasha, and with Puppy, his lovely niece. Rocky can be seen here, at the beginning of the video, walking by my side, followed by his sister Princess, as we are heading for our daily trip around Washington Borough, in central New Jersey, in the afternoon, The killing of Rocky was a despicable, a brutal political retaliation. I didn't do anything wrong. They killed Rocky because I tell people about the wrong things and crimes they are committing against the Cuban people, against the American people, against the people from Venezuela, and against the world, because they are traitors who conspire against the democratic system of the West. Unknown people bang at my door, follow me in the streets, and call my cell phone, to keep track of me, for they to know exactly where I am, at all time. Raul Castro is behind this ferocious persecution and the killing of my dogs. Raul Castro killed Puppy and Tiger three years ago, and now he ordered the murder of the surviving dogs, because he needs the fake revolutionary slogan of fighting against the Yankee imperialism, to continue slaving and oppressing the Cuban people. I got the feeling that all my dogs have been murdered, though, they vaguely say that only Rocky was killed, that the other dogs have been given away to other people, ignoring that I am the only and legitimate owner. The intelligence gang robbed me, using bloody crooks like Diane Bull, the deranged criminal who killed my baby Rocky, as soon the FBI gang that backs Raul Castro, and is persecuting, jailing, disappearing, and killing Cubans since 1959, told Diane Bull to execute my baby Rocky, and a brutal Diane Bull complied with Raul Castro's criminal order, and she killed him. These mercenary agents behave like irrational beasts, hurting and killing my dogs as a barbaric way of torturing me, causing me pain without caring about the precious lives of my beautiful, courageous, intelligent, and sensitive German Shepherds, whose grandfather is a police officer in the Narcotics Unit, Newark Police Department, in New Jersey. They know that taking away the dogs from me, and killing them, is the easy way of hurting me, causing me anguish, suffering, and deep pain. Hello. 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 
Unfortunately, it is not just about killing my dogs. They murder people too. In 1996, with the clear complicity of United States, shadowy, invisible government, Castro ordered the shutdown of two civil airplanes, killing four young American citizens, who volunteered helping Cubans who venture to come to United States, jumping to the water on anything. Many of these Cubans are eating by sharks, or drown on the sea. Since 1959, Cuban intelligence, FBI, and CIA are secretly engaged in the persecution, jailing and murdering of Cuban opposed to Castro brutal regime. The kidnapping and murder of my dogs cause me a lot of pain. They knew it, so they planned it, and they carried it out. At this time, judging by the FBI and Raul Castro gang wild behavior, all my dogs are dead. Their brutality puts the situation on a different perspective. It is not a matter of a guy and his dogs. It is a matter of global terror, about conspiracies that affect the entire world. It is not just about the killing of my dogs, they are killing a lot of people too. It is about murdering and betrayal. The terrorists that killed brothers to the rescue members, also tried to murder Princess in 2014, but Princess was lucky that time. Maybe she is dead now, because Princess was the only dog sent back from Char's Will German Shepherd rescue to New Jersey, to make easier her killing, if I don't satisfy Raul Castro and the FBI conditions, to close my mouth, to stop denouncing their crimes, because these criminal are conspiring against the West for a very long time. And they are backing the traditional enemies with weapons and financial resources. Like the missile hellfire found in Cuba, and these crooks, playing the role of fools, allege it was sent to Cuba by mistake. This is missile technology transferred by these traders to North Korea through Cuba, for the developing of North Korea weaponry capabilities. The conspiracy of the invisible government is worldwide. They back Iran, Syria, Hezbollah, Cuba, Venezuela, and North Korea, an entire block of anti-democratic, totalitarian, and terrorist forces and regimes. At some point, they will move striking against countries like Israel, Saudi Arabia, India, Japan, Pakistan, to overthrow, and subdue traditional powers, regimes, and structures. The Western civilization and its inherent values will be demolished.